invited to a special night with mom and dad. Are you excited? I'm yes. excited. You ready to go? Yes. Do you really want to go? Yes. All right, I'm excited. You have any other questions? I told her I was going to bring a mini Well, I'm that you know all this big news. Now you're so big. <laughs> yeah. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody, get, get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor right this minute. Welcome to Not Enough Nelsons. If you are new to our channel, we have a big family vlog that we showcase all in our life with 16 kids, right? Nine are adopted and seven are biological. And anyway, I just love them all. And so we vlog every day or a few days a week, just some fun things we do and some magic moments in our lives or some really cool moments in our lives. Today's moment is a pretty big moment for Presley. It is her turn to have the talk and so Benji and I have done this with all of our kids. It started with Kennedy, kind of like a tradition where we give them an invitation and we have it like be a day or two after they get the invitation so they can look forward to it. And everyone gets ready nice and we get to go to a fancy restaurant that we normally don't get to go to. And it's just one-on-one -on -one time with just mom and dad, which that doesn't come around very often, you know. Obviously, we spend a lot of time with our kids, but generally it's like with two or three or four of them when you've got 16 kids. But one-on-one -on -one date with mom and dad it's about once a year and so it comes around pretty few and far between so they look really forward to that and um yeah so you can see my washer is broken <sighs> yeah tell me about it with this many kids and having one of my washers i only got one but at least i've got one right so we're making it work until it gets fixed but anyway we are excited to have this special talk with presley if a lot of you a lot of our fans have asked have you had the talk yet with luke or you missed delaney well let me just tell you a bit so i ask my kids before we do the talk video with them if that's okay obviously i didn't have you two back when i had the talk with like our first six kids but then after that we started our YouTube channel and since then I've just kind of asked him like are you comfortable with having the talk you know why we film make a video out of it obviously I kind of silence when I go over the details of the talk but anyway most of them been excited and totally cool to do that but a couple of my kids have opted out have been more of like they have more of a private personality which I have to honor for sure so we won't be showing you Delaney's how Delaney's talk went or how Luke's talk went but Presley absolutely was like yes I love filming YouTube videos and so anyway she's excited to have this special night and she's okay with filming it so that's what we will be able to show you guys so what I'm gonna do first is make the invitation and get it sitting on her bed so that when she gets home from school it's sitting there so let me get started with that Hey girls, come in. It's for you. <laughs> All right guys, Presley is gonna open her invitation. If you're wondering why Presley is wearing pajamas, 
It was pajama day. It was pajama day. For just third grade. Yeah, for just her grade. And Paisley Jane, you're matching me. Did you know that? <laughs> no. You are. We are very much wearing Nike today. All right, girly. So do you remember when you had your? I got a note too. Yeah. It was like, it was like yeah. What is this? All right. Can you read it? You are invited to a special night with mom and dad. You will be treated to a delicious dinner and a, a night on the town. This is not like any other date, but this night will be one that you will forever cherish. Wear something fancy and meet us at the staircase at 7 o'clock to Yay! <laughs> so much fun! So fast! All right, are you excited? Yeah. All right, do you know what special dress you're gonna wear tomorrow? I'm gonna wear my red one. Your red one? Is it fancy? Is it so fancy? Are you excited? <laughs> you look really cute in your pajamas. Sorry, my envelope's a little, a little falling apart. Yeah. I'm sure all of the crafters out there who are amazing crafters were like shaking their head at me too. <laughs> but I try hard to make it special, do you like it? Are you excited? I'm yes. excited. All right. I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. All right. Okay, guys. It's today my special day, and now I'm getting ready to go. And there's my mom. Hey, guys. So, do let's go do that. <laughs> Daddy is here and mommy is here and we are ready to see you. I've already seen her, but. Oh my cute. <laughs> I did not know you oh were, well I did know you were so beautiful, but you look gorgeous. You ready to go? Yes. Do you really want to go? Yes. All right, I'm excited. Do a little twirl, show dad your cute dress. Oh yeah, that's looking beautiful. You look like you're like in the summer. It's I like, know. Woo. <laughs> you can't leave your I phone I wish here, it was though. a summer. But you gotta leave your phone here. You don't need your phone. This is time to talk. I know. So put your phone somewhere. I put it in my locker. Tell everybody, I don't need a phone. I'm gonna talk to my parents. <laughs> here we go. You gotta hold my hand. That's the rule. <laughs> no, 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 no. Go. No. Somebody is a little excited. Just a little excited. Wait, 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 Dad. Wait a minute, you don't understand. When a boy takes you somewhere, whether it's your boyfriend or the, your open father, the he should open the door for his princess. He's chivalrous. There you go. <laughs> now please put on your seatbelt or you need help. Okay, putting it on. And oh, now dear. for the queen. Oh, my thank you, dear. Okay, guys, so. We are on our way. Wait, wait, where's your buckle? Get it over your shoulder, young lady. Are we going to McDonald's? No, we're going to a place with steak and potatoes. Steak and potatoes? That is the princess's request for this special dinner is steak I and potatoes. I love steak, okay? You can't get me wrong. She actually said she would go anywhere, but I said, well, it has to be somewhere kind of fancy so this can be a special memory. And so then she's like, well, I don't like most fancy food, but I do like steak. And I was like, oh, yeah, I like steak too. So where are you going? Um. You already have a reservation? Friday yep. night, 6.30. Yeah, we're gonna have <laughs> we're a gonna... lot of luck. All right, we will figure out a place because <clears throat> I'm determined that we have a steak dinner. And I don't know why I forgot to do the whole reservation thing. I don't know why. Dad, that's your job. Hello? Uh, what were you doing? I made the invitation. You're hey, supposed to make the reservation. Unfortunately, I just kind of realized that yeah. we were even doing this today. People yeah. said, hey, mm -hmm. we're going somewhere tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can't okay. blame me. You know, if someone wanted to get steak so bad and she knew that this was gonna happen, she should have made the reservation. Oh yeah. I don't have a phone. I'm pretty sure eight year olds. You don't did. Care. You, everyone just <laughs> saw your phone because you put it in your <laughs> locker. Hey, I can't say much for that. All right. Well, as interesting as this little family squabble is, we will get on to the montage of us driving to the steakhouse. Some luck in the 
Nice. Mom. Oh, thank you, Dad. <laughs> Do you feel fancy already? Yes. <laughs> There's enough water in that pitcher <laughs> to give us all the drink. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Are it just gonna be the three of you tonight? Yeah. Okay, I'll grab this extra out of the moment. Okay, first of all, Presley, here is the dessert. Look at these desserts, which is ooh, that's like pipe and hot. You see the steam from out there? Now this is the ooh, the shrimp and the crab legs. Are you brave enough to try one of those? No. No? Okay. And look over here. This is all the warm stuff. Yummy. What's under here? Olive oil. Ooh. Delicious. You guys are filming have, while I'm... We have prime rib. Well, I'm getting food. Somebody told you it'll melt in your mouth. You don't like it? You don't like prime rib? Wait, first of all, have you ever tried crab? You don't want to try that? Can I cut it open? You don't want to try it? Can I cut yours open? Break in half. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's dripping juice all over. Subscribe down below if you think Presley should try crab. She's crazy. Break it like this. Camera's over. And then you pull it back slow, slow. Slow. Mmm. Yeah. Delicious. It's not even like cooked at all. It's so good. It's delicious. And we might just have to go to McDonald's after this. Right to the chocolate cake, really. Right. No face? No face. Are you sure? No face. No face. So, do you want me to talk to you about this, or do you want mom to talk to you about this? Are you sure? Look at me. This looks like a face that you could trust, and I could just talk to you, right? I can trust you. So, do you want me to talk to you? <laughs> no. Then why did you invite me? I did. <laughs> I wouldn't have wanted you to come. Do you like boys? Do you think boys are cute yet? Or are you still thinking that they're kind of like, eh? I'm still thinking that. Oh. Do you want to know why mom and dad take you guys on a special date around eight years old? Are you the age that you can be And you get back cash. But the reason that we will tell you when you're eight is because has anybody at school or anybody started talking about them? Nobody mentions that at school yeah. or we're in third grade. Eventually, after third grade, fourth and fifth grade, unfortunately, people start talking about it at school and stuff. And they say silly things. And so what we thought it's better if mom and dad explains it to you before everyone at school and crazy kids in the neighborhood decide to start telling you what. How do you know what it means? What does it mean? Kissing in a bed. <laughs> oh dear. Presley, look how cool. This is supposed to be a serious talk, but I'm trying to be funny. Alright, round two. What you didn't see is that Presley accidentally oh, no. knocked over her drink. <laughs> and now we have another large party that just got here. So we're gonna roll with the punches. We're gonna keep eating, hope that it quiets down and so we can talk. Otherwise, we might have to go have dessert somewhere else for me. Since you've already ate two helpings of dessert, we might just have to talk in the car. Yeah, I think that would be better because it Maybe we'll talk somewhere quieter after that. Okay guys, this is round three. three. I'm trying to have a little bit of a talk. All right, so anyways. Million thoughts are spinning round in my head. I both so sit down 
Cause I'm almost there Now I see you through the window when I'm walking on air But I won't let you know And I know how it goes It's supposed to feel incredible It's too bad you had to leave Please come back now baby where will we Said you so cute. Does that make sense to you? It's good. What do you think this is? Um, a ring or a necklace? A ring or a necklace? That's a pretty good guess. Now you open it. This is so You gotta show, the, show everybody on the camera. Okay. That is a ring. What's on that ring? Do you see anything on that ring? It has a heart. A heart. And, and what else? And a key ring. And a key. And what else is there? There's one other thing. What color? Yeah, it's a red. A red. What's Diamond. red? Ruby. A ruby. Ruby. I'm gonna put this on your ring finger. What's red? What does red stand for sometimes? Love. Love, right? So we want you to know that we love you. And part of this cool ring is me and mom. What? What? What's the shape of a ring? A circle. A circle, right? And circles go round and round, right? Part of the circle is me, you, and mom. And we kind of go round and round because we're a family, right? We love each other. So we're giving you this ring because we want you to remember that we have what we're gonna call the circle of trust. trust. And we want you to know that we trust you and we love you. And we want you to hopefully trust me and mom that you know that no matter what happens in your life, you can talk to us and not be afraid. Even if it's something scary or bad. You can know that me and mom are going to love you no matter what. And guess who else is in the circle of trust? Yes. Yes, for sure. Because you can important. tell them everything. Okay. They know everything. Yes. One day, guess what gets on your other finger? Another ring. What kind of ring? A wedding ring. A wedding ring. So at some point, me and mom, although we'll kind of still be in your circle of trust, one day, as we've talked about today, you're going to find a handsome young man that you're going to want to marry. And he's going to come and say, I hope. Hey, Benji and Tiffany, I love your daughter. Can I have your permission to marry her? Can you imagine that? Today, that ring that you have is gonna get replaced. You can still keep it, but there's gonna be another ring on your finger that's gonna be a circle of trust with you and your husband. And still with Heavenly Father, Father and Jesus, right? Does mom have anything she wants to say? No, Dad, I think that was really, really good. But we love you so much. I love much. it. All right, do you, have, do you have anything you need to teach me? What? Go-karting. Go-karting? Let's go go-karting. What? What? Okay, you want to go go-karting? You yeah. want to go go-karting? Yeah. Okay, well. Well, where do you go go-karting? Dad, she's going to teach you how to go go-karting, I guess. All you right. You me? I'm teaching you. All right. Here we Let's go. get in the car. Professional right there. Thanks everybody. We love you. Bye.